Here's this week's Power Profile. If you haven't been to a boat show recently, you may not be familiar with some of the most elegant fiberglass sport boats on the market today. Topping the shortlist are Chris Craft's line of launches, like this 22-footer I'm testing today. It's been dubbed a retro rocket given its traditional exterior styling and modern day performance improvements. Indeed though, the 22, like its 25 and 28 foot sister launches, is almost in a class of its own and always well positioned to capture a boater's attention. Those familiar with Chris Craft's history can well appreciate the passion that went into building this company. And to our good fortune, the tradition of excellence is carried into this new decade with all new classing and appearance models built using the very latest construction methods. Because the 22 is positioned as a premium sport boat, the quality of each component has not been compromised. Frankly, I can't see the new Chris Craft owner being one to settle for mediocrity. Despite numerous options available to boaters these days, the bow rider is still the most popular design on the water. But most of the time, it's difficult to tell them apart. Not so with the 22 launch. Its soft, rounded, classic lines are complemented with this teak trim, some pop-up cleats, this well-positioned handrail, and one of the most plush interiors in the business. Every seat in the boat is comfortable and conversational. The configuration of the U-shaped aft bench takes full advantage of the 22's wide 8-foot 6-inch beam, as do the densely padded seats in the bow. For sun seekers, the center cushion forward is structurally well supported and completely fills in this area. Given the 22's generous proportions, there are plenty of places to stow things. Aside from the usual under the seat compartments, there is a massive ski locker, in-floor cooler storage, and a lockable glove box that houses the audio system. Of special interest is the way Chris Craft ingeniously engineered the engine compartment to accommodate the boat's hideaway table and canvas. Again, we find modern technology blending with retro styling, like these large, easy-to-read gauges. And these seats are much more ergonomic than they were in the past, and I'm sure very comfortable for long cruises. With so much luxury built into an open-bowed sport boat, the question begs to be asked, is it too nice for everyday use? The answer is no. This boat is designed to be pushed. First and foremost, the launch is powered by a strong and reliable power plant in Mercruiser's 5.7 liter 350 meg MPI attached to a Bravo 3 drive. On plane in a scant 3.2 seconds and staying there at 19 miles an hour or 2400 RPM, the Launch 22 pulls from 20 to 40 miles an hour in just 5.9 seconds and from 30 to 50 miles an hour in 8.1 seconds. Accelerating like a lighter, smaller boat, the 22 is emotionally charged to provide boaters of all ages with some thrills. Spinning a 26-inch pitch Bravo 3 propeller, the engine turned 5400 RPM to deliver a top GPS recorded speed of 56.6 miles an hour. Like a high-end luxury sedan, the Chris Craft tracks as if on rail and feels superbly balanced at speed. Powered by its lively 300 horsepower V8, the hull reacts instantly to flicks of the steering wheel, instilling confidence in the driver. Performance enthusiasts will admire how well the 22 corners. Free of steps, the hull sets deliberately when trimmed under and lifts controllably upon exiting the turn. When dancing across the waves at high speed, I really felt the adrenaline pumping. This is what I'd call a driver's machine. Exciting to operate regardless of water conditions. Simply put, it is a fun, safe boat to drive. You know, Chris Craft has virtually reinvented itself by bringing back what made them strong. Distinctive, traditional, and elegant power boats that set them apart from other production boat builders. That the 22 launch runs so well is a testament to the engineering team who understood that a performance-oriented generation of boaters would not settle for anything less than great handling and maneuverability. Any way you look at it, this is one beautiful boat. We'll see you next time.